In this entire new video, you will now discover, syntax and variables, in Python. Please, do not forget to smash that like button, for the YouTube algorithm, since it does really help supporting us, and providing new free content, once a week. Are you interested to be part of this community? All the links are in the description below. Now, let's play this video. Variable names and syntax. The examples you have seen so far, have used short variable names. But the truth is, that variable names can be more descriptive. In fact, it is usually beneficial if they are, because it makes the purpose of the variable more evident, at first glance. At least you can tell from the name, what the value of the variable is supposed to represent. Officially, variable names in Python can be any length, and can consist of uppercase and lowercase letters, digits, and the underscore character. An additional restriction is that, although variable name can contain digits, the first character of a variable name cannot be one. Moreover, variables' names are case-sensitive, which means that age, age and age are three different variables. For example, which of the following variable names are valid? You may have guessed right. If not, just play back and refer to the previous five rules, or even the style guide for Python code, also known as PEP8, which contains naming conventions that list suggested standards for names, of different object types. There is nothing stopping you from creating multiple different variables in the same program, with the same name. But it is probably ill-advised. It would certainly be likely to confuse anyone trying to read your code, and even you yourself, after you had been away from it a while. Thus, it is worthwhile to give a variable a name that is descriptive enough to make clear what it is being used for. You will see later, that variables are not the only things, that can be given names. Actually, you can also name, functions, classes, modules, and so on. The rules that apply to variable names, also apply to identifiers. If you liked this video, please, do not forget to give a thumb up, and subscribe our channel. Digital Academy, learn free. Thanks for watching this video. Please subscribe. Hit the notification bell. Like, comment, and share.